In previous episodes, we've talked about the different benefits of our functional flowers in application. Today, we are going to look at the salty snacks and breakfast cereal markets, and more specifically, at extrusion processes. Concretely, what are the challenges of these markets and how can functional flowers meet them? To answer these questions, we went to meet our R&D application expert, Anne-Sophie Godard. Hello, my name is Anne-Sophie Godard. I'm application manager for snack and breakfast cereals at Lima Grain Ingredients. And today, we are going to talk about functional flowers in extrusion application. But first, Anne-Sophie, what is extrusion? Extrusion cooking is a cooking and shaping process. From a blend of flowers or grits with water, we form a dough screw driven. The screw works the dough by shearing and heating barrels cook the dough to get a homogeneous melt. This viscoelastic melt is driven at the end of the screw under pressure to go through the die to give specific shape. Back to room temperature and atmospheric pressure, a water flash off occurs and the product expands. Then a rotative cutter cuts the expanded extrudate to obtain the finished product. Products from direct extrusion differ from their shape and color according to their composition and chosen dye. This technology is mainly used to produce seasoned snacks and coated breakfast cereals. And what are the particularities and challenges for extrusion processes? In extrusion, two types of equipment are used, single screw extruders and twin screw extruders. Single screw extruders, because they are single screw, are much more flexible and allow the use of ingredients with a wide range of particle size. The twin screw extruders, because of their two co-rotating or counter-rotating screws, are safe cleaning and more suitable for a wide range of viscosity. However, they are more adapted to finer flowers who can lead to flow problems in the extruder. Therefore, a functional granulated flower with a control particle size may be necessary for better productivity. The heat treatment and selection of a coarser particle size allow to improve the cohesive index. It will be lower and will facilitate the flowability of these flowers. How can we check if one flower flows better than the other one? Thanks to cohesive index measured with a texture analyzer and its border module. As we can see on these pictures, the flower is prepared in a glass cup where a helix will measure the stress during its movement. The more the powder exerts a stress on the helix, the higher the cohesion index and the less the flower flows. If we compare a native wheat flower and a granulated functional flower, the cohesive index is significantly lower for the functional flower. Therefore, these functional flower are recommended for extrusion. They flow better and will not clog the extruder. Thank you, Anne-Sophie. We better understand the interest of using functional flowers in extrusion processes. Stay tuned to learn more about how to meet the challenges of texture and nutrition in extrusion with Innocence Functional Flowers.